out here with the HSP Grampus. This is running a Tamiya ESC with the fan, a 5,000 milliamp battery, so Reedy Pack 20C and a 135 censored. It's a two pole, two pole censored though. 13.5 two pole censored. It was labeled LRP when I bought it, but it's just a blue motor, no name brand. <clears throat> anyway, 2S run, low discharge. This is the infamous concrete mound. The uh, skid plate hit this. The skid plate hit here and cracked and flipped. But um, I noticed the hinge pin was still on when I checked it in the video footage. But I rolled again over here somewhere around this area. And I think that's where the hinge pin flew off at. So I brought one of my slower, my slower rigs out here to mess around with. I kind of want to see this fan and uh, see how it uh, helps the temperature. Because I would go into thermal cutoff every five minutes or so maybe less damn that thing's loud as hell it's a truck with train track wheels on it anyway I would always uh, go into thermal cutoff mode that thing's kind of quick I got it geared up so it'll catch speed after a while It's not bad. Uh, 2S. These uh, these really don't run 3S. You can probably try. I've actually run 3S when it was in brush mode. And it would go for a few minutes. Maybe I'll try 3S now that it's got the fan. If we have a successful 2S run. But like I said before, it would last me about 5 minutes and go into thermal shutdown. So we'll see how, what kind of run times we get now with the fan. I can hear it. The thing's pumping. It's a pretty good fan. So yeah, this is why I wrecked it over here. Uh, the second rollover. I looked at the footage and I noticed the hinge pin was still on the, the Sentin when I first checked it. And then after the rollover over here, when I checked it again, the hinge pin was gone. So, I get lucky. It's a bright color. Yeah, but this runs good. This came with the uh, a Hobby Wing 3652 motor that I've swapped into a few of my rigs. It powers my TT-02B now. And it was a 10BL50. Um, and if you get the Helion version of this, they have their own motor. It's like, I don't know, they rebrand the motor or something. I'm not sure. But I think it might be called Reaction or Reactor. I don't know. But it's different. This one you get a hobby wing system. But uh, right now I'm running the Tamiya ESC and the two pole 13.5 sensor. So uh, on 2S. So it's a little bit slower, but it's got good torque. And it picks up speed. As long as you have enough room. It's got 28 tooth pinion, I believe. Now, I had the HSP Brontosaurus out here recently. And um, that's also the Red Cat Volcano. And recently the Red Cat has come out with their Ducono, which is actually the HSP Wolverine. Um, the difference though, it's pretty big because the Wolverine comes with a Max 10, a Hobby Wing Max 10 system. It's ridiculously fast, especially for that 
type of a short wheel based monster truck. And the Red Cat one, uh, it comes with, I think, pretty much the same system as they had in their Volcano. Oh, hit my foot. I'm not even paying attention. To be honest with you, I'm looking around the ground for my my pin, my hitch pin brace. <laughs> and just kind of tooling around in circles. Well, yeah, no thermal cutoff. I probably would have went in thermal mode by now if it was um, without the fan. So it's a successful fan run. Chances of me finding that piece out here is slim. Unless I came out here and just kind of combed the place up and down, I'd probably find it. But not while I'm driving. Maybe I'll look when I'm done. Yeah, but this comes with like uh, those balloon style tires and a different body on it and it's kind of set up more for like um, to do wheelies and stuff and uh, it's cool it's cool that it does wheelies all the time but um, sometimes you want to be planted a little bit so it's much more planted now um, it's it's geared up for speed and you lose torque, of course. But that just makes it more stable to mess around with. If I had the original wheels on here and the original gearing, even with this motor and ESC combo, I would wheelie everywhere. Even on 2S. Oh, look at that little guy. Oh, he lost, he's off the leash. Look at, what's up, boy? He's a handsome little fella. What happened? What happened, buddy? Did you get loose? What happened? Where's your owner? Did you pull away from him? It's like a beautiful little terrier mix and still a puppy. Good boy, you gonna play? Go get him, boy, go get him. What if it's a girl? What if it's a girl? Pete would love to uh, have a girlfriend. Oh, I think it's a little boy. He's a little pup still. It's going to be a pretty decent sized terrier then. <laughs> get him, boy. You can get him. <laughs> oh, he gave it his all. Look, he gave it his all. He's... You ain't messing around. He's fast too, boy. Look at him get. That little boy got speed. At least he's messing with him. Good boy. Oh, man. He belongs to somebody. He's got a leash and a collar. and a, He might have pulled away from somebody. Oh, they're calling him. Oh, the people must live over there. Yeah, they live underneath that uh, tro the rain, uh, the railroad trestle. Like they're coming for him right now. <laughs> he's just he's just playing with. He's chasing the car around. <laughs> There he goes. <sighs> Shit, maybe I'll come bring my bag of dog food or something. <coughs> but yeah, back to RC and we um I haven't caught in a thermal shutdown though. It's alright buddy. Yeah, it's nice and cool. It's not warm, man, and these uh, notoriously get warm. It's worth the 
20 bucks for sure. All right, buddy, I gotta go. I gotta go, bud. Unless you want a new dad. You fit right in at my house, but you got an owner over there. I know they're uh, homeless people, I guess. <laughs> He's amazed by it right now. Look. He's having the time of his life. Hope they got some food for him after this. He's gonna be hungry. I'm sure they got water. Well, he can drink right out of the Delta. But, uh... I lost it in the grass. These tires are kind of slippery. They do, they do well, though, in dry dirt. Tim Associated puts these on their SCT 10 4x4. Uh, but these came on my, actually came on my FS Racing. Crazy, huh? All right, buddy. See you later. There's another one over there. He got a friend. Oh, I've seen that other one before. It's like a little, uh, it's a full grown dog, like a Pomeranian style mix or something. Let's see, handle the grass, see if it gets hot from running in this grass. It's pretty thick, it's two wheel drive, so. I've, oh, almost, almost. There he goes. Look at him, he's just like. He's a sprightly little dog. He's a beautiful dog. She's very lucky to have that little dog. I hope uh, she takes care of him. If she can, I would. Maybe I'll come bring him some dog food one day. Come out here and bash and bring them back dog food. I'll just go put it over there. They'll get it. So we got more concrete over here to be aware of. At least not. At least I know the dog will have some food. And uh, back to dog food aren't very expensive. Feed that little guy. One of them uh, six, seven pound bags of food will last him a few weeks. Of course, there's two of them over there, so. Well, we're in lipo. Let's see if it's hot. Not really. It's warm, but it ain't hot. Motor and did its job. You can run a full pack through this ESC now. Before you only get about maybe three to six minutes of hard bashing. But um, the fan's definitely worth it. Next thing I gotta buy is a new soldering gun because mine is a piece of garbage. <laughs> Alright guys, peace.